All right, so we bought something. We bought a canoe. In 2020, we did something we didn't know we would enjoy until we traveled and enjoyed many, many beautiful places in Alberta, along with beautiful lakes, beautiful rivers, and beautiful valleys. Who knew one small purchase could change the direction of everything you do? Alberta is a unique province in Canada with over 600 freshwater lakes to be explored and adventured on. Goldeye Lake had to be one of our favorite lakes. It was beautiful, crystal clear. You could see the bottom. Someone to tell you it's too late. Cause these are the best days. We set out to show you some of the ones we've explored over the last few years that have made our bucket list. Let's make the best of tonight. Here comes the rest of our lives. We also got to go to a private lake in North Balliford, which was an amazing lake. It was short, small, and nobody on it. Totally secluded. Great for a family vacation. So far gone. Another face, another friend, another place, another. Then we set off to Big Knife on the river on the shore of the campground was an amazing paddle with lots of wildlife. Big Knife follows the hoodoos. It was like glass the day that we went there and it was definitely a memorable vacation. Someone to tell you it's too late Cause these are the best days There's always something tomorrow So I say let's make the best of tonight The campground felt secluded. We had it all to ourselves. Decided to relax, make supper. Then we headed to Willie Mae Schweitzer Provincial Park, which one is one of our favorite provincial parks we've ever entered to. With Jarvis Lake, Graveyard Lake, and so many more to be explored. We picked Jarvis Lake first, as it was easy to navigate. These are the best days There's always something tomorrow So I say Let's make the best of it Don't wait Cause no one can tell you it's too late Cause these are the best days There's always something tomorrow So I say Let's make the best of tonight There's hiking trails for days intertwined between the lakes. Cache Lake Campground is where we stayed. With only 14 sites, it was a quiet campground we would love to go back to one day. Coal Lake's one of our personal favorite, as it's a short driving distance from Edmonton. It's not a very popular lake, mostly fishermen go here. We recommend paddle early morning or evening for calm waters. But you're magic and I wouldn't have you any other way I thought happy endings were something made up Just for the movies, what dreams are made of I thought happy endings took place to make up the end of the day when you're bringing me a cup of tea the way you say my name not stars aligning a kiss in the rain or a girl locked up inside a tower waiting to be saved I thought happy endings was so just a few hours northeast of Edmonton Carson Pegasus Provincial Park has so much to do Exploring nature, 
or going to Rotary Park in Whitecourt. So I found the real thing, not Hollywood love. Danica still wasn't quite old enough for us to go canoeing yet, but we will be back to explore more of this beautiful boreal forest. But it's hard to explain. or fishing on the many lakes. Just a short drive from Edmonton, Elk Island has some of the most beautiful lakes, but we missed our window of opportunity this year as blue-green algae moved in quick. What's this place called? Uh, Elk Island. Wow, that was good. I'm sideways and up over here. Good job. Look at you. What are you doing? Doing the what? A boat. A canoe. Last thing to do will be to tie that down to the hitch. No you touch and no you taste, but it's in the sky by the next day. I can't do this every morning.
also started a homestead where we can grow our own food and raise our own animals. Homesteading is an adventure all on its own. You can make a salve, like a healing salve out of it, or you can make body butters. There's, there's a bunch of stuff you could do. Sunflower oil and dandelions. Soaking for two to three weeks in there. There's no mold around the top. Good sign. Thanks for watching. Hit that like and subscribe button if you want to see more family fun adventures in Alberta.